Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this tutorial, we will learn how to paint purple sky with trees and a house. Let's get started. First, we are going to do wet on wet technique. I will start wetting the paper with a flat brush from Silver Brush Velvet series. Now, I have taken purple and filling out the sky area. As we wanted an evening sunset sky look, we will paint multiple layers of purple. The colors I am using here are from Art Philosophico Watercolor Confections palette. I will have all the links for the products used in this video in the description box below. Please check it out. Then I will take yellow and start filling the gaps and slowly blending in with the purple clouds that we painted earlier. You can paint the sky plain or cloudy as per your imagination. I like painting cloudy skies. Also here I am using limited palette of two colors to paint the sky. You can be creative and use as many colors as you wanted. Remember always paint through your imagination. I am going for the second layer with the purple and blending it so that it will look much darker. Once I am satisfied with the sky, then I will start with the house. I will take light yellow and light grey and paint the wall. I will start painting from right to left diagonally and make sure it is darker in the right and gets lighter when it comes to the left corner. Here our light source is from the left, so the shadow will fall onto the right side. Then I will take brown and fill the roof of the house. Now I am done with the basic layer of the house. We will leave it to dry and start working on the trees. As it is sunset, most of the trees we see will be dark and slightly green in few places just where the light shines on them. I have taken dark green among the shades that I have have and started painting the bushes. But I wanted more darker green. So I went in and mixed a bit of black to the green and made it more darker. Now I will continue painting the bushes. You can paint the bushes, small, huge banyan trees or pine trees as per your choice. Just try to recollect a view that you have already seen when you are traveling and put it on the paper. Once I am done with first layer of bushes with the green, I will take dark grey and paint the second layer on the bushes. This will give us the sunset effect where the trees look partially dark grey and green. The trick with layering is making sure that the first layer is always partially dry. If it is wet, the paint gets mixed and we will not see the two tone effect and if it's dry, the grey will cover the entire green layer. Now I will start painting the coconut trees in the same way how I did for the bushes. I will do the first layer with the dark green what I was having and then once it is dried, I mean partially dried, then I will go back with the dark grey and just do a second layer of it.
Once I'm done with the trees, I'll start detailing the house. We will outline the windows, doors and the face of the roof with dark brown. We will also paint few slant lines on the extending roof. Then we add small rectangles on the wall so it will look like a brick wall. For that we will wet the wall and then we will take with light brown but darker than the wall color and start painting the rectangles. We need not be precise in painting them. Just do it with a loose hand. It will come around. Do it a similar way with a bit of the more dark grey colour for the top floor wall. You can get creative with more other detailings. I have added few small birds that are flying in the sky. And we are done with the painting. Thank you and please don't forget to subscribe for more painting tutorials. Let me know what you think about this video in the comment section below. We'll meet you in my next video. Until then, happy painting!